like a roller coaster, but uh, up during the journey. And I'm on my way to, to higher, higher levels, so, you know, but it starts with this fight. Come late We're going to have to find a cat. I'm looking forward to uh, a really tough fight. Why? Uh, I think we got that. So, I just take you You've had all the accolades, you know, championship fighter of the year, acclaim. What do you expect from this year, Terrence Buckhorn? So, what next level is there for you? Just keep on winning. That's my motto. Just keep winning. And everything else is all in place. Where would you rank the as amongst the challenges you've had in the recent, in your recent history? Who's your bucket list fight and number one fighter on the bucket list that will from your greatness? No, I don't know. You know, uh, that might be, you know, it is annoying for me. What are you looking at? And I don't listen. I don't say. I don't do it. Let's get. You know, but like I said, I'm not overly moved by your anyone. How's the state of Nebraska going? Oh, it's cool. Omaha, still behind you? Okay, Alright, good luck on May 20th. Thanks. Hey, bud, right. this year the Knicks have been trash. It's, it's, it, I mean, as a New Yorker, it's painful. Can you assure the New York fans that you're going to put on a better show than the Knicks huh? in May? Oh, yeah. I'm going to put on a show. You know, my Lakers been doing pretty bad, so, you know, I can't brag about what the Knicks been doing. We need a lit boxing event. Right. We need somebody to fall down on that night. Oh, yeah, it's coming. But how's it going? Andy yeah. Emilio is new to the big house, Madison Square Garden. No. I'm not doing no interview with ES News. Boxing voice. We good? Boxing voice? I don't even... Y'all be, be putting out some bulls. We're here. Shit. Boxing news. Bo boxing voice. Boxing, boxing voice. voice. Boxing voice. With the nest of, you know, boxing the voice. Yeah. Hey, give a message to me, man. Y'all biased. Give a message to uh, Boxing Voice. Give a message to uh, Give a message to Boxing Voice. The guy, the Boxing Voice. Trash? No, no. Antonio <laughs> <laughs> Baez, DC Mike TV. Terrence, May 20th. Felix Diaz. How do you feel about the fight? I feel good about okay. it. Not looking past Felix Diaz. Real, real quick here. I'm looking past what you, Felix Diaz. What can you expect from Felix? He gonna bring his AK. One more fight, two more fights. He in shape. He's gonna fight hard. I know he's gonna come prepared, ready. And I'm gonna do the same. And that's gonna make him a great fight. What can we expect from you, May 20th? Great A. Great A? You know, the best of Terrence Crawford. He's a kind of a small target like Gamboa was, you know? You find those small targets maybe a little bit tricky. I, like I appreciate that, bud. Thank you. I appreciate that. I appreciate that. He's small, but at the same time, that's what the training is for. You know, you make your adjustments in training. You, know, you get acclimated to the type of fighter that you fight. Mm -hmm. You learned a lot sparring from Tim Bradley, too, back in the day, right? When you were coming up. And I remember seeing a video that when when you were coming up and you gave when you when you were working with Bradley you you came to fight him, right? Where like most of his sparring partners weren't trying to have that. Right. You always had that hunger. You always you know whether it's sparring or whether it's a, in a pro match, you're just going for it all the time, right? One hundred. Right. Present now. That's just me. You know, every, every time I step foot in the ring, you never know what what, what may happen. You know, you go in there, last the days of cool, or go in there playing around, and that's how people get hurt. You can't play boxing. You competitive like that in any sport you play, whether it's boxing, basketball, football, whatever it may be? Everything. I don't care what it is. I don't... You're not PlayStation. Everything. <laughs> Everything. Everything. <laughs>